Welcome back to the Beers and Bar Show, and I am here today with Dominic Keane, and he is one of the owners of the Wicked Shamrock here in Lompoc, which happens to be one of my favorite watering holes. So, Dominic, uh, nice to see you again. Nice to see you. Now, there's a lot that Wicked Shamrock has to offer. It's not just music entertainment, but tell us a little bit about, about what, all the beers you have on tap and some of the specials that you offer. Well, we have uh, 42 uh, tap handles, um, and those include mostly beers. Um, we have uh, a, one gourmet soda if you're a non-alcohol uh, drinker, and we have about three to six different ciders on taps. And if, all the beers we have on tap are um, premium craft brews. There's no domestic beers on tap. Nice. And you do offer certain promotions during the week, and tell us a little bit about those. Yeah, we, we, uh, we focus on generally on a brewery, um, or we'll, we'll focus on a season. Um, right now we're um, doing a Ninkasi uh, um, beer tasting. It's a sampler, uh, a keep the pint glass. Um, and uh, what it is is you're able to come in, try different beers from the, um, from the um, brewery, and uh, you know, decide which one you like, and, you know, and basically um, keep a pint glass and, and have a beer. Now, I myself have been known to come and shake a tail feather here. Tell us a little bit about the bands that you feature. Well, uh, we focus on bands from all over. We, uh, we have our local bands, which are absolutely amazing. Uh, the Center Coast offers quite a few uh, amazing bands. Um, but we also uh, target bands from you know, all, over the, uh, all over the nation, actually. We have bands coming from Florida. We have bands that just come, you know, they get off tour over in uh, Hawaii, and they, they come this way. So um, we've actually been very lucky because um, you know, the history of what the bands and stuff that we have, we're able to get better and better bands, it seems like, every single season. So um, it's just been getting better and better. <clears throat> we're, we're lucky we have had, had bands come through that, you know, I've idolized as, as a kid. Um, and we're lucky enough to have bands that, um, you know, they play in Santa Barbara, they do stop in Lompo, and, and they play up in San Luis. So, you know, we're featuring some of the same bands that are in, you know, in some of the other cities where you have to drive an hour, you know, away to, to go see a band. And it's pretty fun. I have to say that the age range here is is pretty interesting to me because I see I come in here and I'll see 25 year olds and I'll see 55 year olds sitting right next to them. So it's all ages as long as you're 21 of course, uh, but there's a little something for everybody. Now tell us a little bit about where we can find you, where we could look up the listings for the different bands coming on and the different promos during the week. Uh, a couple places. Uh, you can find us on uh, the 100 block of North 8th Street in Lompoc, uh, but you can find us at uh, thewickedshamrock.com. Uh, and you can also find us on Facebook. Um, Facebook generally does the spur of the moment. If we have a band that just called us the night before, um, and we'll list it, and we just we send it out there. We um, we do a lot of social media, uh, and for me, uh, it, it's a great way to get get the word out. You know who's playing. So thank you, Dominic, for showing us around and telling us a little bit about the Wicked Shamrock. I hope you viewers take advantage of the situation as well. Come see the live bands for yourself. Come taste the great beer. Come have some good times with some good people. Yeah, and uh, I thank you guys for coming out, and um, I hope to see you guys soon.